Hey there, it's Ty, and welcome back to Vlogging Every Day in April. Today is April 16th. Alright, so I'm going to talk a little bit, and it's going to be very brief because I'm on my way to the gym, gotta go, but about a couple books that I would recommend to read, but quite a few books to choose from. You know, um, but I can pick a couple of favorites. Now, you know, I think this is kind of strange, but um, I can read a cookbook from end to end even though when I cook I don't even use recipes but 1,000 vegan recipes right here look at that it's a big book definitely I would recommend Roots when Ben was being punished um, when he was about I don't know maybe 12 I had him read Roots he ended up loving it it wasn't really a punishment, it was a learning experience. Another book that I had Ben read too, The Life of Pi. Um, this is a great book um, and it has a really cool twist at the end and um, the book is left up to your interpretation. It could have two endings. You can interpret it one way or you can interpret it in another way. It's kind of interesting. and. Um, Anything by Eckhart Tolle, A New Earth, Awakening to Your Life's Purpose. The Power of Now. There's another one of his books, but um, very great author. The Way of the Peaceful Warrior. I'm just going to go real fast. I don't even talk about them, but um, um, definitely a book that could change your life. My Two Moms. Uh, this is by Zach Walls, and he was a, he is a guy who was raised by, you know, a lesbian couple, and, um, yeah, good book. I would always recommend, uh, to support the LGBTQ community, and any books that they write, and, um, I will recommend right now, Before I Had the Words by Skylar Kurgel. See right there? So, just a few books that I would recommend. Um, there's so many more, like, really great things, great books. Uh, but gosh, I don't have enough time to even pick a favorite, or I can't even figure out a favorite. So, uh, boy, I love Flowers from Algernon, um, Women's Roots. Gosh. There's a whole book of uh, great short stories up there. Tons of cookbooks. Oh, and where's the one I wanted? This is what I say a lot. Everything happens for a reason. I don't know if you can read that. Everything happens for a reason. I truly believe that. So, anyway, that's my little take on all these books. Um, I didn't say very much about them, but I would recommend you reading them, and I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye. I'm sorry.